The shove mechanic in Baldur's Gate 3 can ruin an encounter, and I love it. The article discusses the gaming experience with Baldur's Gate 3, focusing on the use of the shove action in combat. The writer had been heavily relying on their Githyanki warrior character, Blazel, for combat until they discovered the strategic advantages of the shove action. This move, part of the Dungeons & Dragons 5th edition rules that the game uses, allows a character to push an enemy out of their melee range, potentially causing damage and leaving them pro. It can be used to force an opponent to use movement and actions to regain ground, or to move an enemy within the range of an archer. The writer learned the hard way about the effectiveness of this action when a goblin boss character used it to push Lazel into a chasm. The writer appreciates that the action is not explicitly an attack and can replace an attack action. They also note that, while I didn't frequently use the shove action in tabletop sessions, it makes more sense in Baldur's Gate 3 and adds to the feeling that the player is on equal footing with a computer opponent. The use of this action in the game showcases the blend of Dungeons and Dragons' limitless imagination and Divinity Original Sin's exacting combat system. So thank you all for sticking around till the end of this video. If you enjoyed a deep dive into the dynamics of the shove action in Baldur's Gate 3, tap that like button. Your support helps us continue to provide quality content on the latest in gaming. Don't forget to subscribe to stay updated on the strategic intricacies of your favorite games, just like we explored today with our Githyanki Warrior Lazel. We appreciate every one of you. Happy gaming.